What's going on guys, it's Sam Souter. Welcome to my Jersey Shore Bachelorette vlog. So we are celebrating Kristen's Bachelorette this weekend. She is my cousin. Her mom is actually my godmother, so I've grown up with her. She is the closest thing I have to a sister. I'm an only child, if you guys didn't know. And this is my first Bachelorette party. We're gonna be in Ocean City in New Jersey and I will give you guys the whole rundown, but tonight we are doing a wine night in a taco bar and tomorrow we are headed to Atlantic City. So it's gonna be a wild weekend. And I'm super excited. Kristen is marrying Kevin, who we love oh so dearly, and we're really excited for him to be a member of the fam. He's so much fun, and I love hanging out with him too. So, I guess that's the background, and let's hit it, guys. Let's have a weekend. Here we go! Oh, we made it. This is Kristen. How are you feeling? Hi, guys. We're feeling great. We're, we're happy to be great. here. Friday, Bachelorette weekend. Super excited. We're ready to go. Stoked. It's gonna be a great weekend. Look how cute. Here we go. And then you got your rice, your standard salsas, cheese, lettuce. This is a like a slaw, yeah. basically cabbage slaw, mango. We did one ground beef taco and one fish taco <laughs> and some cornbread. We are heading to bed. We had a really fun, chill night. We watched <laughs> My Big Fat Greek Wedding and we had drinks and we played games and we had a taco bar that was fire. And tomorrow we are going to go to Atlantic City. So we'll keep you posted on all the festivities of our Jersey Shore weekend. But so far so good. We didn't want to go too hard tonight because tomorrow's a big day. Right, ladies? Right. Yeah, all right, so we're heading to bed. Night everyone, see you tomorrow. Good morning party people, I don't remember Remember the last time I slept till 10 a.m. But I slept really good. We are about to go for a hot girl walk. I think this set, it's actually a onesie. I think this onesie is from, I wanna say Lane 201. It's like a little bit form fitting up top. I know there's like a little bit more room on the bottom. They're kind of like joggers. I really like it. And we're gonna head to the boardwalk and walk around a little bit, eat some breakfast out there. And then we're gonna come back and we're having a bartender come to the house to make cocktails with us later. So that should be fun. If you've never seen any of my Jersey Shore vlogs, stay tuned. I don't know if I've ever done one in Ocean City, to be honest. This might be your first look at Ocean City if you're not from here, so let's go. Good morning, everybody. We already got the bass pumping, some sea pain. Look at her and her cutie little set. Looking totally fabulous. <laughs> Within an hour, it should be cleared up. So we are doing some tarot card fun over here. So Tina just read me in my cards and it's very interesting because it's pretty similar to the reading I had done February 12th at um, the event in Maniac I went to for Valentine's Day and I don't know, they're saying very similar things like that I'm transforming into someone new and then I have to like embrace that and let that happen and let go of my old self basically. So kind of deep. It's a small world. <laughs> Julian is dead <laughs> was my orthodontist. So Kevin, how are you related to Kevin? I'm his cousin. So Juliana is Kevin's cousin. So his uncle Tom was my orthodontist for two sets of braces. My, my teeth were so jacked up that I needed two sets of braces and like he had told my parents before the first set that I'd need two. So now, like 10 years later, we're Beautiful. staying there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're staying there for the weekend for Christmas Bachelorette, so kind of crazy. The more you know. So if you've never been to the boardwalk, it's like all kinds of shops and food and games and mini golf, things like that. There's a ton of really fun stuff to do here. A lot of families go up, a lot of like friend groups come up here. And it's just like something really fun to do after the beach or for the day. There's also like a Bronco show happening. The best fries. Woo! Candy ring. Guys, look, we found another bachelor party. They want to play kickball. I'm going with kickball. We're going to investigate the scene. Okay guys, our cocktail lady is here. Kristen, where's your outfit from? You look stunning. Sam, I don't know, you gotta check the tag. Okay. <laughs> Oh, it's from Nordstrom. And it's very beautiful. I will leave it down in the description box. Yeah. I think it's perfect for bride to be. Super cute, really high quality. And the bottom has got cute little tassels. So we love an high in the back, back, little eyelet design. Sam, where's your outfit from? 
This shirt is from Super Down. I will leave a link below. And these jeans are from One Teaspoon. I've had them for a really long time. But, you know, just something cash, obviously. And I'm not casual at all, but it's the bride. Yep, and so. I have all this really cute bracelet, this bride one, which is from a brand called Little Words Project, which oh. I love. And you can um, kind of track oh. them like friendship bracelets. Love that. Cute little bride accessory. Let's make Ooh. some cocktails. Wow. Here we go. Perfect. <laughs> So cute. Now that I draw, you want to get all the way to the top. Okay, I'm going to flip it over. There's a jalapeno in there. There we go. Jalapeno. Have a strawberry too. Oh, we want a strawberry too? Yeah. Yeah, I know it's kind of hard. Yeah, muddle that. But yeah, you each other all. So then we're going to have one hand on the bottom. We're going to do one hand on the top. And we're going to kind of like put it over the shoulder. Some of them might just come up, come yeah. open, and that's great. But then sometimes if you locked it really good, it will, you know, we're gonna need to pop it open. So we're gonna find, like I said, how there's like a straight side, and then there's one with like the gap. Yeah. We're gonna kind of go like one o'clock. We're gonna go over like on the side there, and that's where you're gonna apply some pressure and like pop it. Shake 10 towards yourself. There you go. Yeah, oh, there we go. Yeah. 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 So drink number one was a margarita. Chris and I added two jalapenos to make it spicy and also a strawberry. And it's really, really good. I didn't know that like a margarita is actually supposed to be like lemon juice, lime juice, and agave and not like mix. Oh yeah. <laughs> we made but, our own mix. But it's way better than that for sure. But we have three more, I believe. Cheers. Watermelon, we're doing watermelon jalapeno. We're getting crazy over here. Kristen's the designated muddler. Muddle, 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 muddle. <laughs> Good work, girl. So she said you have to take it, go to one o'clock, and then put your thumb there and put pressure on it. <laughs> oh, the bar. Get it. Do you guys think I should bartend down the shore this summer? Let me know. Oh, wait, you got the strainer? So this is the Paloma, drink number two. A splash of Coke soda and then a little bit more ice, and we're ready to roll. So our Lavender Fields cocktail is about half an ounce of lavender liqueur, which is pretty cool. Woo! All right, guys, look at the vibes no, for AC. No. So the Uber is coming in 30 minutes. I think I'm gonna wear this dress. I'm not really sure. I do like this, but I feel a little bit exposed. I don't know. The girls are telling me to wear it, and I feel like it's like a hot dress, but I just wanna make sure like I'm comfortable because we're going to dinner and stuff. I'm also gonna put on this shimmer oil. I got this literally at a gifting. I think at Miami Swim Week, which like if you guys follow me, you know that that was so freaking long ago, but I haven't used it, and I saw it in my bathroom cabinet, and I was like, if there's anywhere I'm gonna use it, it's this bachelorette weekend in Atlantic City. So we're using this Truffle Therapy Shimmer Oil by Skinny Co. Shout out to Skin and Co. Thank you. And we're going to Izika for dinner. I think that's what it's called. I'll link it below. I've been there twice before and it's honestly one of my favorite restaurants I've ever been to. It's amazing. It's Japanese and they have really great sushi and like super great appetizers yeah, and I really love it. So 30 minutes and then we're out and we will film tonight for you guys. YouTube, you this is my cousin Lauren. I don't think you've met her yet. Hello. Okay, Lauren is one of my closest 
cousins. Uh, I don't know if you guys yeah. have met her, honestly. Okay, well, um, right now I'm like I don't putting. Think. I don't, maybe at Olive Garden, that was like it. Yeah, maybe like at Olive Garden. Yeah. So Lauren and Melissa are sisters, and I think you've seen Aubrey on the vlog before. So Lauren and I and Melissa and Kristen are here, mm -hmm. and we're having a great time. Yeah. Love you guys. Bye. I'll get my brothers, I say that I here we go. We're going out tonight. We just had our Jimmy driver stop on the side of the road to get a sunset photo. We're gonna put it right here. If it's not good, I'm so sorry because we really stopped the car for that one. Spiro, Spiro, it had to be good. Subscribe. Good night, Kristen. Hi, everyone. It is 2 p.m. on Sunday. We woke up. Um, I rolled out of bed at like 10.30. I actually got out of bed at 7 a.m., made a bagel, and then went back to bed. But I was not feeling great this morning. It took me a little bit to get moving, but I just shot a photo on the beach for a Javianas campaign, and I literally haven't left Ocean City yet. Like, I was the last person out the door today, and we had so much fun last night. I loved all of Kristen's friends and all of Kevin's family members and we had such a great time. We went to Borgata last night and we went to the restaurant. I want to say it's called Azaika. I'm definitely butchering that name, but I'll leave it down below. It's a Japanese restaurant. It's literally amazing. And then we went to Premier Nightclub and we got a table. So we had so much fun. There was a bachelor party next to us and we kind of like mingled with them and we were just like dancing and having the best time and we didn't get home until like 3.30. But yeah, so thank you for watching my Jersey Shore Bachelorette vlog. Kristen gets married in about a month and we're so excited. I love all the girls. I can't wait to hang out with them at the wedding. And if you have any questions about anything Jersey Shore related or anything for me in general, just leave them down below. And I'll see you guys next time.